Hey Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So we have our weekly Google Chrome security updates that have been made available, which once again rolled out late yesterday in my part of the world on the 12th of February. So because we are dealing with security issues, it's important to double check your browsers up to date by heading to your main menu, help about Google Chrome. And latest version in build after update has been applied is sitting on 133.0.6943. Point ninety eight or ninety nine, either or, on Windows, Mac, or Linux. Running version one thirty three means your browser is up to date and fully patched. Now, for this week, we get four security fixes that have rolled out, and thankfully, there are no critical vulnerabilities or any zero days that have have been exploited in the wild. And it's been quite a long time since we've had a zero day. And a critical vulnerability that needed to be patched, which I think is good news. And the four security fixes that have rolled out are all high severity security flaws, which is ranked just below critical. And they are common exploits once again for the Chromium browser. The first flaw that's been addressed is user after free in the V8 JavaScript engine. Then we get inappropriate implementation in browser user interface. And then we get use after free in navigation and out of bounds memory access in the V8 JavaScript engine once again. So four security fixes have rolled out in total. So just double check your browsers up to date because it is your first line of defense uh, to the online world. Now, I've noticed something else that has become more widely available with the rollout of this latest point release update. And that's the AR innovations. And I posted on this with the version 133 version upgrade that rolled out for Chrome um, last week. And I'll leave that video linked um, down below and in the end screen. And on my Windows 10 device, when I posted um, the 133 video, this was called Experimental AR, which it still is. But I noticed today, after this point release update, that I have now received the AR innovations. And when 133 rolled out, I didn't have this. So AR innovations or experimental AR is now becoming more widely available. And I'm not going to rehash everything in 133, but just a quick recap. Um, this is Google's reimagined Chrome supercharged with AR. And the first AR innovation or experimental AR feature to roll out is history search powered by AR. Go check that video out on 133. And if we just pop over to the Canary browser, which is an early preview version. It's currently sitting on version 135. If we head into our settings, just to give you a wider overview, AI Innovations has got the history search powered by AR that's now rolling out to the stable. And there's a couple of other AI Innovations that are available that haven't made it to stable. Automated password change and compare products. And I might leave one or two of these videos linked down below and in the end screen regarding automated password change and comparing products if you would be interested. But just wanted to bring that to your attention because uh, I have noticed with point release updates for Google Chrome that they are starting to push out a couple of, a couple of extra front-facing features that don't roll out with the version upgrades. So four security fixes plus AI innovations is becoming more widely available now with this latest point release update. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.